Oh, yeah. You ever had noodle kugel? Mm. I hate kugel. That shit is fucking interesting. To yeah. Say least. <laughs> <laughs> and admittedly, I haven't had that much in the way of Jewish cuisine, and I'm sure there's a lot of tasty dishes out there, but, man, kugel is a travesty. It's, <laughs> it's like... Egg noodles with gravy and fucking raisins yeah, in it. Yeah, raisins. And it's you, you're eating it, and it's like it doesn't work. Mm. It's like having a bowl of uh, cereal in the morning, right? But for some reason, some asshole put pickles in it. Like it just. It's, it's good, like, but there's this over here. It's like shit in it that just doesn't make sense. I probably told you guys like my, <laughs> my favorite episode of anything ever on the Food Network is one of those food challenge shows where this dude has to go prepare like a huge banquet me- feast for uh, a Jewish like, community center. Oh, this is the uh, pig dude, right? Yeah, and apparently, you know, he he's like struggling to like get all this kosher food and he meets like the one Jewish person in charge and he's like, yeah, this might be a problem, but and he like pulls his like shirt collar down and there's a tattoo of a bacon strip on his chest. Of the guy cooking the Jewish food. Like, he loves bacon so much. He loves he got a tattoo pork and of bacon. bacon? Yeah, there's a tattoo of fucking bacon on him. And he's just sitting there sweating. I'm like, oh boy. I gotta... What, they think, he's gonna, they think they're gonna beat his ass or something? I don't know. It's just, uh... You could just say you used to be a cop and you got you up. People used to I, call me a pig. I, I will you go like, on record. I think, uh, I think the kosher thing is extremely silly, though. You're a, oh yeah, I got bacon tattooed on me because I used to be a cop and they used to call me a pig, so I thought it was funny to embrace It's better that. to say I love bacon. I like you fucking... Ugh, look at you. You don't eat bacon. Ugh. The Jews aren't fucking Nazi Germans, man. It's not like they're gonna... There are a couple Jews. There are a couple Nazi Jews. I know. That's besides the point. It's not like they're gonna... Two or three. There are a couple. Look at you and be like, oh, you eat bacon? Fuck you. Fuck you. They'll hiss at you. <laughs> <laughs> I think he wanted to put, like, bacon and pork in all the recipes. That's why, uh... Oh, that's a bad idea. Yeah. I, I think... just I just think, yeah, the whole kosher thing is weird. It, the biggest problem for me is that if you have that little stamp on your package of food, it's like, oh, it's okay to eat, you know, it's governed by whatever, yeah. but... By King who, Jew. Who's to say... <laughs> King by King Jew. By King Jew, King of the Jews. But... <laughs> Like, and with the crap that, that comes out of <clears throat> factories and shit, you're, you're telling me that, like, I'm sure a lot of kosher food is good, but I'm sure people have been in the rules because people are inherently fucking lazy. Oh, no, <laughs> They're really doing yeah, the whole no ritual they have to, like, precautions. cut a cow's throat in the proper way. I keep, no. I keep reading about these Hasidic Jew rabbis. Like, do you read about that, Zach, when they... Um, the Hasidic Jews? When they, you know, when they circumcise babies, they'll oh, actually... Oh, they suck the dick of the baby. Yeah, yeah. They'll suck the blood out with they their mouth and then give them, the give them like, a yeah. disease with yeah, they get herpes and shit. They it's brush their up. teeth first? I yeah, with the dick. I mean, it gave dick. me a huge heart on, but... <laughs> <laughs> what? So they actually, I like, mean, nip the tip off and then suck, suck the it. blood out? Yeah. Okay. But then they give it gives them uh, herpes, baby's herpes, and some die from it. How do you get hurt? Well, doesn't the... Uh, the dude, the big dude who sucks the baby off has herpes. Yeah. On his mouth, and he sucks the baby off. And well, he's makes, not sucking the baby off. Oh, yeah, he is. Kind of. Maybe he doesn't see it as a sexual thing, but... He's sucking the baby out. Well, Well, I guess the sexual view is playing with the kid's balls and stuff, too. uh, Yeah. (laughs) He's like, this is tradition. (laughs) (laughs) The face of the tits, which one? I didn't know that. That's kind of, uh... It's fucked up. It's interesting. Creepy. I'm gonna stop reading stuff on the internet now. 